Our nominated Senator Veronica Minor has reiterated the need for women to have a safe space to discuss various issues affecting them online. Speaking during the 67th session of the UN Commission on the Status of Women, Senator Minor noted that online violence affects the psychological and social aspects of women. She further noted that such acts of violence impede democracy by preventing women from taking up positions of leadership and governance. The session, which began on the 6th of March and is set to run until the 17th, is an initiative by the Commission on the Status of Women, CSW, the principal global intergovernmental body exclusively dedicated to the promotion of gender equality and the empowerment of women. The 67th session coincides with the celebration of the International Women's Day worldwide. If digital violence is not addressed in time, there is a risk that gains made in guaranteeing freedom of expression, political rights of women, and right to dignity will be eroded. If women cannot feel safe to discuss issues vocally in online communities, freedom of expression in the Constitution will be infringed. Indeed, women will have to reconsider seeking elective and political positions if the disinformation and bullying is rampant, which will impede on democracy and derail participation of women in governance. If we were to speak the truth, when women feel unsafe, they step back. Because when online violence comes into play in a woman, in a, uh, a woman who is seeking a political office, normally what they do is to abandon that ambition, especially in our jurisdictions. In Kenya, under the Constitution, um, there is a protection of rights under Article 28, where the right to privacy includes the right not to have information relating to the person's private affairs unnecessarily revealed and the right not to have a person's communication infringed upon. In few instances, we've had an situation where these rights have been infringed, but cases have been taken to court. There is an act of parliament, the Computer Misuse and Cyber Crimes Act, where this has been criminalized, where child pornography, uh, publication of data, cyber harassment has been criminalized, and that means that offenses can be, uh, people can be fined up to 10,000 USD for...